Let's see. Here we go. Oh, it's a really good one. I mean, I'm just catching and releasing. I didn't know there was no fishing. Fish. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh my God. Oh, my God. Fish. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's another nice one. It's even freaking bigger than the first one. Oh, it is a chilly, brisk one out here today. I think it's like currently 36 degrees. Freaking cold. What is going on, guys? We're back with another video of The Fishing Dream. I hope each and every one of you guys are having a fantastic day out there. I first want to thank you guys so much. We just hit 3,000 subscribers. We're almost at 4,000. I don't know what's going on, but you guys are awesome. Keep it up, guys. So today we're going to be going over to a couple of ponds. We're going to see if there's any bass in these ponds. These three places or four places, I don't know how many places we're going to, but these places are very new to me. I've never fished any of these ponds before, I believe. Um, we're gonna be throwing around tubes, uh, rattle traps, ned rigs, all that good winter baits for these winter bass. I hope you guys leave a like, subscribe if you guys are new, of course, cause you know, we're doing a 5K giveaway. Stay tuned for that details at the end of this video, guys, stay tuned. Watch this whole video in full. Trust me, there might be something little hidden in there for the giveaway, so. Just, 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 just stick through it. I hope you guys enjoy. Let's get on over to the pond and catch some fish. Alrighty. All right, so we're at spot one. We're gonna give this little tube jig a shot here. We're gonna see how this works and uh, hopefully catch some bass. Fish. Oh my god, first fish on the tube jig. New spot, first cast. The freaking tube. Oh my god, yes, and he choked that thing. I have not caught a fish in literally so long. Let's freaking go, guys. I need to get that picture in there. Alright, so first fish on the tube jig right here. And I hailed that bait too. Me. Oh buddy, chill. I'm trying to help you. There we go. Right there, guys. First fish in forever. Oh, cold water bass. Oh, nice catch and release. Dude, that water's like so freaking cold. What the heck? I knew I had faith in this bait today. <laughs> oh my God, let's freaking go. He bit right on bank. He must've been chasing that thing up. <laughs> it's epic. Let's go get some more. Cold water. I literally have not caught a bass in like over a week. It's insane. I've not had the chance. I've been so busy with school and getting so much stuff done. It's crazy. Pretty easy bait to use. You know, kind of figure it'd be a good. Oh, right there. Oh my god. No, I literally lost something so big. No. You guys saw that, right? That was massive. No. Dang it, guys. Dang it. Oh my god. That freaking sucks so much. Oh, that does suck, though. That was a really nice fish. That was a really nice fish, guys. Spawn's loaded with them. Oh yeah, oh, it's a fighter. Oh, it's a good one, it's a really good one. Oh, it's about a pound. Oh, maybe even bigger. Oh my God, I'm so happy I'm catching bass this time of the year. That's literally two fish right there, that's epic. What a day, this is already turning out really good and they're inhaling this bait. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm really sorry, buddy. It's like in his gills. Okay, the bait is out. Took me a while, but we got him. Let's make sure he swims off good. He's a little bit bloody, but I think he's gonna be okay. Oh, sweet, it's two bass. Two bass, that was a nice one. I keep choking the bait. That was about one pound. Whew, some stud winter fish right here, guys. I'm happy. 
It's not that often where I catch bass during the winter time, you know? Fish. Oh man, lost it. Something small. Fish. Oh yeah. Oh gosh. It's a nice one. Uh, you know, it's small, but it's the fish. It's a bass. Hey, catching bass, even this size during this time of the year, that's epic. See, he's been feeding on craws right there. It's red mouth. This is a great bait to represent like a craw, especially this time of the year when they're like changing colors or whatever. But right there, nice little, really small bass, but it works. Doink. All right, so I think I'm going to go give the rattle trap a shot not that this bait isn't working but it is but the fact that i want to give this lure a shot now that's what i want to do so just set that rod down right there i think this could be this could do probably pretty good let's just see let's get it out there that's all i needed to do There we go. Oh, it's a really good one. On the rattle trap. Oh, right there. Nice. Rattle trapping in December. Now, if I just don't want to get hooked by this buddy. Okay, there we go. All right, not a baddie. Not a little baddie. Another tiny little bass. About a half a pound to a pound. Little buddy. You got to get away. Stop eating uh, fake stuff that aren't real. Oh gosh, that guy wants to go. He's not happy. Okay, I'm putting this away. Rattle trap is not, also not doing as well as I thought, but we, all, we at least got a fish with oh, okay. We at least got a fish with it, so that's a good thing. Just it's not the results that we really want. Put this bad boy down carefully. And let's go whip out the tube again. I have faith in the tube. I think we could go catch some more fish. Um, so now let's just see what this is about. Oh, there's a bobber floating here. Is that any good? Yo, aren't these bobbers like expensive? It's all cracked. Let's see. I gotta whip that down there. I'm gonna fish against bank over here. There could be a lot of bass schooled up over there. So let's fish. First cast on the drop. Literally on the drop right at. What's oh, a good one, too? It's not a bad fish. Oh, yo, this is the biggest one of the day. He's got something on his lip. Oh, that's disgusting, that lip. Oh, God, he is. He's some type of growth on his lip. Buddy, I'm going to help you. Oh, hell, it's on me. Okay, it's gone. I just saved you, buddy. You just had, like, a parasite on your lip. I hope you're happy. Hope that knocks some sense into you. All right, don't really want to do much of a release, so. There he goes. He's off and gone. Literally first cast after switching up. That's insane. <laughs> that's pretty good. Oh, yo, 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 no, 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 no. Oh, wait, no, I got a... Wait, no. No, I caught a fish and it snagged over there. Hold on. Yo, no way. Okay, watch out. I'll be back in just a second. Uh, how am I going to get up? You guys. Oh, no. Dude, I just hope this guy doesn't fall off. Hold up. Oh. oh my god. Oh no. Oh, I got a fish. Oh. Okay. I got a fish right here. He's gonna go back. Oh, okay. Oh my god. You guys are stuck now. Oh, that was wild.
yeah, that was a, uh, that was something. Okay, let's tell you what happened. So I was casting down there. See all those bushes against the side? The wind brought my bait into them, but the bait went in the water. As soon as it hit the ground, a bass came up and smacked it. I then was wondering what the heck was going on here. And I saw a bass flying out of the water into a bush. So I then hopped over the fence, went over there, got the fish off thankfully, and got my lure right back as well. So let's please not have that happen again. I was, oh. oh, here they are. Dude, these little six-year-old kids, what the heck? I can't catch and release. I can't catch and release. Oh, they're just playing around, it's fine. Fish. Fish right there. Tiny little bass. We're gonna switch up to a different bait. Let's get the Sanko out. Alright. Sanko's being tied on. We'll see about this bait. Maybe this will work. Oh, fish! Right there! I didn't even know. Alrighty. On the freaking Sanko. Sanko in December. I know this thing works all year round, but I've never really caught a fish on a Sanko in December. Oh, that guy's hooked pretty well. He was just running with my bait. I wasn't even paying attention. Beautiful little bass. There it goes. Catch and release. That's all what we are about. Fish. Oh yeah. Dude, it's something nice. Oh my god. What the heck? Holy cow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is gonna be my PB. What the heck? What the frick? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, this is like a seven pound bass. What the heck? Oh my god, I got tangled up thorns. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, guys, oh call dad. 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 Oh my God. Guys, I can shut my freaking hand. Oh my God. Oh my God. Alrighty, fellas. I think, I don't know what you guys tell me, five or six pounds, massive. It has a huge belly. Okay, I got it on my camera right here. But oh my God. <sighs> Last look at him. <sighs> been out of the water for a couple minutes now. I really want to give him time. Oh, okay. <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my gosh, guys. Literally, I didn't know that fish was going to be that big. I hooked into something big. I thought it was freaking snagged. It might have been a catfish or something. I freaking saw the head of that thing. Oh my god. I could put my whole hand in there. I, I'm literally still shaking. My feet are soaked. I had to go in the water for him. Oh my god. My hands are all cold. I'm all red, but it was all worth right there. 
my whole finger's all caught up from his teeth. Oh my God, that's when you know you caught a big bass. You just put your hand in there. Oh yeah. Oh, it's another nice one. Oh my god. Dude, 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 dude. Oh, oh, it's another stud. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, it's even bigger than the first one. It's even freaking bigger than the first one. Oh my god! Oh, oh my god! Oh, oh my god, it's even bigger than the first one. Oh my gosh! Oh, 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 oh my god! Dude! Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> it's not the same fish. It's not the same fish. No, it's completely different. Oh my God. <laughs> what the heck? Another stud. This guy's probably about four and a half to five, probably about five pounds right here. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Let's go down here, release this beast. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Jeez, that guy's wanting to go. <gasps> what the heck happened there? I don't even know. Two bass over five pounds. One video in freaking New Jersey. One thing to say, let's get back to fishing. Oh my gosh, dude, dude. I'm actually like speechless right now. I need to replace the Sanko. What? Yeah? Now, I've tried there before. I'm just, I'm just catching and releasing the fish. No, 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 I don't eat fish. I was. Well, that's what they're saying, huh? No. Yeah, just, just don't be, uh, I, I, I'm just... There's no fishing line in the pond. I don't know, like, what's I mean, I'm just catching and releasing. I'm, I don't eat fish. I, I don't even have a cooler with me. I won't, I won't come back here again. Okay. No, I know, I know. I just, I've never been here before. I want to give this spot a try. I didn't know there was no fishing. Yeah, All right. I won't come back. But if you, if you don't mind, if I could just. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah, I understand. Thank you very much. They're still talking. They're getting their parents involved now. Yeah, I'm probably gonna go to the back pond now. Their parents are getting involved. Yeah, they're talking and everything. I'm gonna start leaving. <laughs> oh my god, their parents are telling the kids to go over there. Yeah, let's leave. Alright. Yeah, when adults get involved, then, you know, then it's something. Alrighty, fellas, so that is going to wrap it up for this video here. I think, I don't even know how many bass I caught. 
I just know we caught two bass over around five pounds. I know the first one was definitely five pounds. It was massive. Second one was big as well. Um, we caught about a couple other one pounders. Just a pretty good day. What we did, I just, I told you guys everything. It's just, I was fishing there, right? I didn't know there was any fishing signs. No fishing signs, right? There was these kids. They were telling me, I guess, something about fishing. I didn't know what they were saying. I just knew something about fishing. I was kind of thinking, hmm, maybe there's no fishing here. So I you know I kept fishing. And then I had this other kid come over. I think he was older. He was around my age, 16, 17. He was telling me like something like, hey, there's no fishing here. I'm like, oh, really? And he was like, yeah. And he was like, you're apparently upsetting the kids and you got them upset. And I'm like, oh, I didn't even say anything to them. Um, and then he was like, well, yeah, apparently they were getting upset over something. I got it all on film too, which was pretty cool. I, I respect him. I fished a little bit longer. He was like, you know, I have no problem you fishing. Just, just, for, just so you know, like no come here in the future. So I'm sorry if I'm not editing this. I'm just all putting it in one clip. I'm sorry. But then the kids, the little six or seven year old kids, they went to their parents. They started talking to them about it. I heard the voices and stuff about fishing. And I'm like, you know what? I'm out. I really don't want any, gosh, it's windy. I don't want any problems. I want to keep things positive. I don't want to make anybody upset. So I just left and I'm right here. In this big, huge pond type of thing. I don't know. I haven't caught any fish here before, but thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I know this was a lengthy video, but you know, big bass, long video. And I'll catch you guys next time on the fishing room. Keep fishing. Have a good day.